Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020-2021 Panini Mosaic UEFA Euro Soccer. What a tournament that was. This is break number 19 from a fresh case too. Sold 12 spots. One spot gets you two countries on this list right here. So let's double you up like Sir Mix-a-Lot. Just PJ, David, and Brian in on this. Thank you very much, gentlemen. Appreciate it. There are the teams right here. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Six and a four, ten times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then four more times, right? Yeah. Seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. Got Brian down to David. Six and a four, ten times for the teams. One, two, Three, four, five, six, and tenth and final time. After ten, we got Russia down to Portugal. You know, uh, so most of you know, I was making picks for entertainment purposes only throughout the tournament. So I had some futures plays that actually worked out pretty nicely, and I did all the, I did the math yesterday, and it turns out that. All the money I lost playing matches, I won back with futures plays, and I basically broke. I broke even. So, all that. I had fun with it, but all that just to break even. Brian with Russia and Slovakia. PJ with Hungary. Sweden, France. Brian with Switzerland. PJ with Finland. Brian with Poland and Denmark. PJ with England and Scotland. Brian with Wales. PJ with Ukraine. North Macedonia, Germany, Czech Republic, Belgium, and Spain. I had a, I forgot that I had a futures play on Pedri to win young player of the tournament, and he did. And I was also on Italy to win right there as well, and they did. Although, personally, I wanted England to win. Hart was with England. The wallet was with Italy. Brian has Turkey and the Netherlands. David with Austria. Brian with Croatia. And David with Portugal. All right, so let's... See if we can get this right there. Let's sort by uh, let's sort alphabetically by country, and trades are allowed. But I'm going to switch away from the screen just for a second. We're going to pop open this fresh case, and we're going to see uh, which two boxes we're going to. This is Mosaic UEFA Euro Hobby. So there's stacks of two, right? All right? We'll just go one, two, three, four, five, six on the dice roll, and that's the two that we'll select. We'll use that die. And it's one, that's easy. The left two right there. And these we will save for next time. Just grab all these at once. And next time I'll probably just grab just two random boxes. All right, so we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. We'll see if there's, see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. I'll be right back. All right, welcome back. No deals were done, so this list right here remains the same. Thanks, everyone, for spending a bit of your Monday night with us. I appreciate it. Got the home run derby on the background. Pete Alonzo raking. He still has like 45 seconds left. He's already at 21, 19, or there's 20.
25 home runs for Pete Alonso. Still has a minute left. Leads the field already. The pitchers for this? Yeah, that old guy out there is an all-star. <laughs> no, it's usually they're like pitching coaches or like an old high school coach of theirs or something like that. To uh, that, that throws him the ball. There's a uh, Igor Deveev, rookie red for Russia. That'll be for Brian. An all-card ship, of course. There's another Russian rookie there. And there's Bukayo Saka, who, youngster, really young, but missing the crucial penalty at the end for England. That was a rough way for them to lose it. But they've got a really exciting young team, England. Guys like Jack Grealish, too. He's already at 31 home runs, Pete Alonso. Woo! Eighty-eight out of ninety-nine. We got Hans Hatteborer. Wow, he's got thirty-four home runs. Woo! There's Jao Felish for Portugal. Portuguese youngster going to David. And this goes to the orange. That is for Brian. For Slovakia, there's Stanislav Lobotka, a mosaic parallel rookie. That is for Brian. In Slovakia, there's Diogo Jota. It's Kai Havertz. Germany, PJ. Yeah, I don't I don't yeah, I don't think I don't think uh, I don't think Salvador Perez is gonna gonna advance here. I'd be shocked if he has thirty six home runs in this round. And there's our autograph. There's Mark Andre Ter Stegen. Nice auto for Germany. PJ with the Germans. All right. And the second box. Brandon saying what? Pete's a great interview. Yeah, he seems like a like a good interview from what I've seen.
Oh, you know what? I'm watching the StatCast. He's on the other TV, I think. I'm watching the StatCast version of this. Should I go to their main broadcast? Second box, good luck. There's the Italian keeper, what a great job he did throughout the tournament. Did he win? I think he may have ended up winning the player of the tournament too, Donnarumma. Uh, that's for Italy. That's going to go to Brian Croft. Shane Sant, another youngster. They'll learn. That England team will learn a lot. It'll be interesting to see how they respond in the World Cup. After these guys will have some little more experience under their belts. Got a Ennis Bardi, 33 out of 49 for North Macedonia. Pink parallel for PJ. You know, I think uh, last year, just, just pre-pandemic, Pete Alonso, um, I, some of you may remember we went to that Topps uh, million card rip party in Dallas. And Pete Alonso was there, and uh, I, w I wasn't on that trip, but... The guys who went on the, then that trip were saying uh, how great he was. There's Nico Williams for Wales, Brian Croft. Mbappe for France. It's PJ with Le Bleu. Another Sancho for England. Oh, and a redemption for the autograph. Interesting. And let's see what this this uh, redemption is going to be. It's going to be nice Euro autographs mosaic Phil Foden for the three lions. Another youngster. Yeah, England in spite of a disappointing final, they do have a good young core of players. So it'll be interesting to see how they do in the World Cup in the next uh, year and a half or so. And that is PJ with the three lines. Let's see if it comes home for them. 
in the World Cup. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.